Hello and welcome to a new video on my Animal Crossing channel. It's a new day, it's um, Thursday and yeah, it's raining and that's really beautiful. I really like the rain in Animal Crossing. It's so relaxing and it sounds so relaxing. So let's enjoy a rainy day today. I'm really excited to get started. We have some mail here. So let's check out what we got. Uh, we have a letter from Rosie. I think I wrote her a letter. To my bestie Sarah, I read your note a bunch of times. Très sweet stuff, so heartfelt. I'm writing a sad song. I'm shooting for a song that'll make folks cry. On purpose, I mean. Well, time to go to dance practice. Fashionably early Rosie. I think she's a really popster. <laughs> Sarah, congratulations. To celebrate the new addition to your home, please accept a small gift. You need convenient electronic appliance for your upgraded home. Happy Home Academy. So I... Um, took the time yesterday and caught a lot of fish and upgraded my house so now it's a little bit bigger and you can see it has a different design because it has like um yeah a different design and it's bigger and we have more space so i would say we go inside and check it out Ooh, it's so big now we can move everything that we have to the wall i actually really like moving stuff around like this i know it's probably not very useful in any situation like in um every situation but i think it's cute that she's just moving around stuff so when we have several rooms, we're going to make a separate living room and a bedroom and a kitchen and maybe a bathroom that would be cute as well. But for now, we're going to keep it like this. We have a like room for everything. Okay, I should probably do it like this. So I'm just moving everything towards the wall a little bit to use the space that we have. I really like our interior um, furniture uh, so far, but it will be better sometime. So I can't wait to check out the store actually, because I really want to buy new stuff. So I think that's cute. I'm going to keep it like this. Now we have a lot more space here and I also, uh, I'm not sure if I made this bed in the last part, but I also made a design for the bed. So like this green squares thing and we also got some nook miles. So let's just check out our nook miles first and then we will do stuff. And so we get miles for upgrading our house. Oh, we have 2000. I really want to make another island tour, but I feel like every time I go to an island, it's super boring and I all only get my native fruit and everything is really annoying. So I don't know if I want to do that, but maybe, I don't know. And I also upgraded my pockets, so I have one row um, more in my pockets and we have still the present to open. It's an ironing set, that's so sweet. I should bring it into the house really quick and then we can walk around in the beautiful rain so let's see I also have a shell fountain I think boomer gave it to me that's cute I guess yeah I'm going to keep it there and we're going to put this in storage and now we can go. So I don't know what today's plan is actually, but uh, we will see. Oh no, our laundry will get wet. Um, I also added some stuff here. I think, I don't know if I recorded this to be honest, but I built this oven. I think I had that in my last part, but I also added some new cedar trees here off screen because I love cedar trees. 
so I think that's really nice and we really need more cedar trees and there's a snail can I catch it if I find my net come to me no that was really bad never mind I'm sorry <laughs> We still have no hybrids, I don't know what I'm doing wrong, maybe the chances are so low because I feel like in New Leaf it was so easy to get hybrids. I was just putting out some flowers on the first day I moved to the island and I immediately got hybrids. So and that's really sad because I really want some different colors in my town and there's Boomer, he's a leaf umbrella, this is so sweet. So I'm going to hit on the rock really quick and see what we can get out of the rock nope so and this time I didn't forget to put the weed away oh that's money rock that's really ha really nice because we need money desperately for our next loan which is 100,000 and uh, 189,000 I think it's 98,000 <laughs> 198,000 bells, which is a lot, so we need to save up for this. And yeah, I'm really um, a little bit disappointed because in New Leaf you could just travel to the island on the evenings and catch a bunch of bugs and then you would have a lot of money. I mean, it was really annoying to catch the bugs for me personally, but it was at least a good method to get some money and... Um, in New Horizons so far, I couldn't really get a lot of money by just doing stuff. I was fishing yesterday and I feel like I didn't really catch a lot of rare fish, um, at least at the beginning. So at the like um, later on in the evening, I got some more rare fish, but not like too many. So it's really hard to get the money together and that's really frustrating me. But um, we don't have to rush, we have a lot of time to finish all that, so um, there's no need to worry, I guess. Um, I'm going to hit on that rock again. I feel like my shovel will break soon, because I feel like I have this shovel for a really long time, and it might break some time, so let's see what we can get out of this stone. And also Timmy um, sent some money to my bank account because I put the fish into the box yesterday evening. And yeah, I'm the person to have the money in my pocket. I don't like to have it in the bank because I never know how much I have in my bank. So I'm going to take that money from my bank account to see how much we got. And we also might buy another Nook ticket. I feel like I have to do that. Oh. Well, hello there, Sarah. Your home is much roomier, yes? It's nice to have a even, have a even little extra space. Which brings us to... The cost of your remodel. That'll be 198,000 bells. Hmm? Ah, yes. Please make sure your payments using the Nook Stops ABD feature, as you've done before. As always, it's been ever so nice doing business with you. Yes, yes. So sweet, Mr. Nook. So sweet. Welcome to Nook Stop. So I'm not going to pay that right now because I probably can't. But we get 250 um, Nook miles, which is great. So let's see what we got in the Nook, nook Shopping section. I'm always curious to know. Camping cart... Yeah, we don't need that. I really, really, really bad want new clothing, but I really can't um, decide on what to do. So I was looking for designs online yesterday evening, probably for two hours. And I just couldn't decide on what I want to wear with my character. So I didn't do anything, which is really annoying because I really want to change up everything a little bit. But I'm just too indecisive, so... We have anything to buy for the nook miles? 
Yeah, we could probably also buy the hairstyles, but I feel like if I buy another Nook ticket, I get to an island which is not worth the travel. So um, then I went, uh, then I go back really disappointed. So do we have anything good here? I think it's the same, like in the beginning. So can we save up for anything else? We can save up for customizable phone case kits, but I'm not sure if I need that. And yeah, I think we can buy the hair size later. We're going to get another Nook ticket and we hope that we will get on a better island this time. I don't want like that much. I just want another fruit so I can plant different fruits on my island. Um, I really want to replace all the orange trees because I'm not a, really into oranges. I don't care too much about it, but I'm not really into oranges, so I might I might change that. So let's go to our ABD and get some money. I want everything. I like to have it on my um, pocket so I know how much I have because I keep forgetting how much is on in the bank so I'm going to keep it on my pocket. So next we can go to Nook's Cranny and see what we can buy there. I'm always excited for shopping. I feel like that's the best part when you start a new day in Animal Crossing like go through all the stores and go shopping. Why would I use the bridge? Makes no sense. I feel like a lot of people get money from the tarantulas, but I just can't catch them. I just can't. I tried yesterday again, but I just can't. Every time I see a tarantula, I really want to go far away. And I want this boat and a bottle. This is so cute. So I buy this. And what do we got in the wallpaper section? I really need the clothing store. I really want to buy more clothes. Um, I think I might buy the white pansies. I'm not sure what kind of flower this is because I am not good at flowers at all. But um, let's get this one. And this one as well, because they are white and I like white flowers. I wanted to buy five, not one. And we also might buy some more cedar trees. Can I buy five as well? Yeah, so I'm going to get five cedar trees. We have new recipes, flimsy shovel. No, 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 no. I think we already have all of them. Oh, I can buy an orange. Why would I do that? I have a lot of orange trees in my town. Maybe if I chop down all of the trees and then I don't have any more orange trees. So I can buy one here. This, that will make sense. Thank you, thank you. Goodbye, Timmy and Tommy. Ooh, I love the rain. It's so beautiful. Very nice. So let's go ahead. I really like that I can plant the trees basically everywhere because I can move them later on if I want to. So that's so great. I just can plant them like everywhere I want and it's not set and I can move them anytime so I think that's the best part might place some more cedar trees here and I also think I would like to have a villager right next to my house oh we can invite new villagers now I think so maybe we should do that when we do an island tour so let's plant some more cedar trees around the town I'm going to plant them pretty random right now 
because I don't know what I will build on all the spots in my town that will be um, yeah that will be unknown until later so I'm not going to make a plan for the trees but um, I think like around the house this is pretty much planned so I think that's so cute with the cedar trees here and the oven and everything I really like the outside it's so chaotic and not like super organized and stuff and we also should plant some of the flowers that we got the the pansies and the other ones And I also think it's so great that we can now buy several flowers from one flower and not only one every day. <coughs> like a new leaf you could only buy two flowers because there were only two flowers in store every day. And the same with the trees you could only buy one tree every day which is really unfortunate. But now we can buy cedar trees every day and normal trees. I'm going to plant all the flowers around town. I hope I will get my um, hybrids finally because I really want to know if I'm doing something wrong or is it just... Or do I have to be just patient and wait for it? I really would like to know that. So, plant all the flowers here. But not too close to the stones because we need the space around the stones. Hello Boomer, what's what's poppin'? So um, I'm going to take some stuff into my inventory so I have stuff um, space in my pocket. And then we can go make an island tour, I can't wait. So maybe I will be disappointed again, I really think I will. Oh and we also have a new villager, I forgot. So we have to say hi to Gala first. And then uh, we can go on an island tour. I'm going to put some stuff into my storage. Um, maybe some wood as well. I was also thinking about just putting the wood on the ground around my house. So I don't have to carry it in my pocket and it looks um, decorative and it's still... Um, yeah, it's still very close so I can use it. I think that would be a good idea. You can probably do it like this. Yeah, I think that's enough space. I don't need like um, so super much space. I'm pretty sure the island will be really unspectacular. And only with like the basic stuff again. So let's check on our nook miles. Flower power. Planting flowers make our island more beautiful and you can earn miles. So grow wild. Yes, yes. Yay, some more nook miles, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and say hi to our new villager first. Or neighbor, or whatever you want to call it. She has a cute house. Mm, I really want to have cocoa in my town, I think. She's so cute. Hello. Oh, she's so sweet. Hey, neighbor. I'm new here. My name's Gala. And you're Sarah? Nice to meet you. Sorry, my home's such a mess. I haven't finished unpacking. I hope to have you over again. Once I've had a chance to tidy my place up and settle in, snorty. Yeah, I would love to have um, to come visit you again because you are so sweet. Maybe we can meet new villagers when we um, go on an island tour now. That would be so cool. So I'm only running on the beach. I don't know if it's bad for my grass if I ran over it. But I'm trying to avoid it. So let's go to another island. I'm really excited. But I'm also thinking it will be really disappointing again. I just want some other fruit. I really want to like to have peaches. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to your one and only getaway to the skies. The Birch Airport. How can I help you out today? 
I wanna fly. Roger. By the way, it looks like you have a, got a Nook ticket on you, in case you feel like using that. So, just to get the paperwork all official, where did you want to go? I want to use my Nook Miles ticket. So you want to use your Nook Miles ticket, Roger? I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute, but let's just check you all packed. Tools all ready? Yeah. All right, let's get you... I didn't press, I pressed um, the button too quick. Dodo 1, this is Dodo Tower, Wilbur. You copy, get a walker who needs wings o over. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? What would they do? I don't know. Cherries! We have cherries! Alright, we are two down and docked at the target island. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar is go. Meanwhile, I'll be in a holding pattern here. Get in touch when you need tools or travel. Go! Catch some bees and chop some trees! Yay! I'm going to catch some bees and chop some trees. We have cherries! And we can also sell them. I think they're uh, more... Um, they bring in a lot of more money because they're not our native fruit. And that is awesome. So I'm going. I don't know if I want to have cherry trees in my town. I probably won't because I would like to have some peach trees. And I also don't want to have that many fruit trees in general. So I'm trying to avoid that a little bit. But I'm getting some cherries to sell to the Nookling store to Timmy and Tommy. So I can um, get some money and pay off my loan sometime in the future. So let's shake all the trees. Now I also want to walk around the island for a bit and see if we have something special. I think it's all, always the same. It's like, yeah, we have some fruit trees and we have some flowers, which are always tulips for... Um, for me at least and well, I think tulips are my town flower I guess so because I all also um, I only saw tulips in my town um, when I started so this might be my town flower I didn't know this was a thing but I feel like every town has a different flower to start with and for me it's tulips I'm not the biggest fan of tulips but I'm also not not a fan <laughs> If that makes sense. I'm not a fan of red tulips. I'm also not a fan of red flowers and yellow flowers in general. I don't like this color scheme of red and yellow. It's just not, not my thing. It's just not for me. I feel like these trees have different colors. Like look at the this cherry tree and this cherry tree. This is has a lot more like it's a lot greener I would say. This is interesting because I always thought um, the normal trees and the fruit trees had different colors, but this seems to be a new thing. Maybe we can also ca catch some fish. I have plenty of space left in my pockets, so maybe we can catch some fish here as well. Can I do it like this? Come over here, my sweet little fish. Can you see that? Oh, I really hate when they um, bite like... Oh, what is this? Oh, wow, it's so big. Oh no, not my, not my fishing rod right when I need it. But I think we have a workbench here, so we can probably build a new one. I'm also really um, uh, indecisive if I want to sell the fish to pay off like my loan, or if I want to keep them to put them into the museum. So I'm always checking on the Critopedia app, and if the fish is 
special to this month or this like this if it's um disappearing in uh, after march i might donate it to the museum so i um, have that so can i build craft whatever <laughs> i don't know if i have the materials for a fishing rod probably not but i also don't want to spend nook miles on that But I pretty much all only need tree branches, so I think I can just shake some trees and get the tree branches pretty quick and easy. You have to shake long enough and then you will um, get some tree branches, even though you thought there weren't any in the tree. So let's collect them. I think we need five, so that should be fine. And make another fishing rod. Great, we made a flimsy fishing rod. No, I didn't want to keep crafting. So now we can fish some fish. There's another one. So I'm not talking while I'm fishing because I'm really concentrated and I don't need a sea bass. They're not worth a lot of money and they're really boring and, and nobody wants them. I feel really bad for them now. So let's go on this side of the beach. Some fish are really annoying. So there is the... Okay, so I got a little, <laughs> get a little nervous there. So let's see, can we go around here? No. Too bad, but we can also fish some fish in the river. I'm not doing that too much because I thought they would be um, not so expensive fish. Oh, what is this? Okay, we already got this one. So I'm trying to catch the fish, but I actually can't see. So we will see how this will work out. Wait, I can change the camera angle. Yeah, I will find... Somehow I will get this fish. Gotcha! Oh, what is this? A yellow perch. I feel like that's a new fish. It's not. Another yellow perch. I really like this camera angle. That's really interesting. It's probably good if you're walking around town at night and don't want to walk into a tarantula like I do. Um, so I might go up and get the rest of the cherries there. Because we still have plenty of space in our pockets. And we want to be rich. <laughs> so 
so oh there are some left on the uh, right here and we should also hit the rocks to get everything that we can before we move back home so let's see let's take our shovel and get this rock yeah we got everything out this is so great But I also really want to have uh, an island with like hybrids and stuff like that. I've seen so many different types of islands you can um, go to and I'm really sad that my islands I arrive at are always so boring. Like they're always the same. That's really frustrating. I mean I'm glad I finally got a different fruit than my native fruit probably would have liked to have like apples or peaches I don't know if I really want to have any fruit trees in my town but if I want to have some I might um, go with peaches because they're so sweet and yeah my town is going to be really foresty and um, I don't know if that really fits my theme maybe apples would be cute as well but I don't care too much about the fruit that I would like reset my town um, at the beginning or something so that's not that big of a deal for me so we got the stones we got um, a couple of fish I mean we could probably fill our inventory before we go home with some more fish so let's see what we have here they're pretty small I'm not having that high hopes for small fish but let's see I hate when they do that so what do we have it's a crucian carp I feel like I never had that before but don't we get like a message if we get have a new fish? So we probably had that before. So let's see, do we have some more fish here? Oh, there's another one. Quit. It's off the hook. And one more. Another squid. So I think we're full now, so let's get back to our town. Bell Bottom Bebop, this is Stovetop Paperweight, do you require assistance? Uh, yes. <laughs> you ready to punt pontoons and fly soaring? Lily here back to Birch. You positive? Be very positive, because I wouldn't want you leaving anything behind. So again, you ready? Yep. Roger. Lifting of November Oscar Whisker. <laughs> yes. Nice. Let's go ahead and now we can sell a lot of stuff.
and hopefully get some money out of it. I love the rain, it's so calming and so nice and relaxing. I so love it. Yesterday when I was playing I was just thinking hopefully it will rain soon and then it rained and I was like yay. So let me just sell that really quick. I have a lot of stuff. I hope the cherries are um, worth some money. I also have a sea bass and whatever this is and this and this and this and this. So much stuff. Hopefully I won't sell something wrong. So that should be it. Oh, that's a lot of bells. Is it like because of the cherries? I hope so. I should have probably planted one of the cherries to um, sell them in my town as well. But that was really bad. So we have some more nook miles here, which is also really great. So we have um, 67 bells. I really want to say simoleons, but it's not. It's bells. So, yeah, we're a little bit closer to pay off our loan, but not too much, I guess. So, I shouldn't have planted this flower like directly next to the stone. So, I'm going to move that really quick and put it somewhere else. It's nice that you can move the flowers, but I feel like moving flowers in new leaf was a lot easier because you could just pick them up and didn't need to dig them up. So <laughs> um, I think that was a lot better. So let's get the weeds. And hit on the rocks. No, I, I, I keep digging the wrong holes, so like this. And to get everything out, just... No! Uh, I knew that would happen. So, and to dig every... Uh, to get all the stuff out of the stone, just keep pressing A as fast as you can. So now we need to get a new shovel, but I also really want to have new furniture for my house. So let's see if we can find anything else to do and just walk around for a bit. I think that's also really nice to just walk around and enjoy the rain. I feel like we got a lot of message bottles already, so I think I've, I also... Oh, blah, blah. I probably got around five or so, like... um since I started my town here and that's a lot isn't rain like the weather to catch sharks I feel like I um, yeah I feel like that was when you get sharks but I feel also feel like that it's a little bit different everything in New Horizons because I um, thought tarantulas were um, only in spawning in summer, but in New Horizons, it's in the winter month, and that's confusing to me. So I might change the terrain later on here, because I think to have this tiny space here on the side is not pretty practical. It doesn't really do anything to the town, and the same on the other side, so I might just um, lower that part here. Like from here to somewhere over here, probably around here. So we only have that part. I think that would look a lot better. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I also met Wisp yesterday night when I was playing around like 11 p.m. And... He was um, asking me to collect all his 
spirits that he lost and I think it was about five and I caught all his spirits and brought them to him. Oh nice. Oh old tiger. Oh I have an idea for DIY recipe that's so nice. Show me. That's really boring. I don't want to know that. And I found all his spirits and he gave me a wallpaper. I think it was a hard wallpaper. I didn't want to put them in my room but I think it's a cute one. I kept it and maybe I will use it in a different room later on. We will see. I think this would be a great place for the campground. Like right between those trees at the waterfall. I think that would be really cute. For the campground. Don't know when we can build it, but I think that would be great. Oh, there's another fish. Can I go there without? Okay, I was just thinking, <laughs> um, I might end this episode here, um, I hope you don't mind that. Um, I think it already got pretty long and I don't know if I make a second episode for this day, but I will see that and you will see that as well on my channel. So stay tuned and please subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my videos and my content. And I hope I will see you in my next video and I hope you have a great day and goodbye.